there are the sponsors. He's the last of three January signings for Everton, and Mikel Arteta has just one aim, helping his new team to Champions League football. I will try to make my best and be very professional. Like I came here with a lot of uh, illusion and spirit because uh, it's a big chance for me and because also the club has a, a great chance to be in Champions League next year and I would like to make my best to try to help them to be there next season. After losing Thomas Gravison and Kevin Campbell, David Moyes was hoping to strengthen more in the transfer window. Having watched Arteta for some time, he's hoping the move could become permanent. It was one we, we've thought about for a while, we wondered if it was going to be there. But uh, to get him in loan, you know, was the biggest thing. Because what we can do is we can see how he does, you know, and uh, if he does well enough then we've got we've got a price in there that we can purchase him for. Uh, if he doesn't then, you know, we know what tends to happen then. Arteta's move from Rangers to Real Sociedad didn't go to plan, making just three starts since August. He's currently nursing a knee injury but hopes to be fit in time for their match against Southampton this weekend. I'm getting better. Uh, I have to train really hard this week to try to be available on, on Sunday or, or when the gaffer uh, thinks that I have to start playing. Arteta will have to make do with watching his team from the sidelines when Everton take on Norwich tomorrow night. He's four months in which to impress both the manager and the fans if he's to keep his new shirt. Vicky Gombasor, Sky Sports.